Hello everyone, in this video we will discuss about the vibration terminology. So cycle is basically the motion completed during one time period. So motion means what? The movement of a vibrating body from equilibrium position to one extreme position in one direction then back to the equilibrium position then to the other extreme position in another direction then back to the equilibrium position so that is called as one cycle of the vibration for example if we take the case of a pendulum or maybe a sine wave so from one extreme when it goes to left sorry from right back to extreme then to left then back to extreme so this is one cycle similarly we see in this one wave from equilibrium if we consider this as the equilibrium position to one extreme back to equilibrium then the other extreme and then back to equilibrium so this is one cycle so the first term is the time period or it can also be called as period so it is the time in terms of seconds and it is the time taken to complete one cycle here we can see this is the complete cycle one crest one complete crest one complete trough it is showing one cycle so whatever is the time taken to complete a cycle is the time period now frequency is what the number of cycles that are completed in one second in one second whatever is the number of cycles that are completed that we denote by frequency and its SI unit is Hertz and frequency is reciprocal of time period. Now what is the amplitude? This is the amplitude. The maximum displacement of vibrating system from its mean or the equilibrium position. This is the amplitude denoted by A. If we consider this as the mean position, so this shows the maximum displacement. Natural frequency. Now whenever there is no external force acting on the system, after giving an initial displacement, the body vibrates as a free vibration. So, for example, if we take the case of a pendulum, you give it certain displacement and you leave it. After that, what happens? The pendulum, it keeps on oscillating itself. So, that frequency of free vibration is the natural frequency when after giving initial displacement to the body, no external force is being applied. That is the natural frequency. And the condition when the natural frequency of the system becomes equal to the external force in that case is called as the resonance. And when these two frequencies, the natural frequency and the external frequency, they both coincide, resonance condition occurs and in these cases the amplitude of vibration is very large, right? And it's, it's so large that it can also lead to the failure of the system.